Hello, my friends and subscribers. My name is Alexander Stepanov. In this amazing video, I will tell you about the common mistakes that nail technicians do in their work. The first mistake when we use the rubber base for gel products. These nails were made with the rubber base and after that the sculpt and the gel were placed on the nail plate. The, the mistake was uh, that we, ne we should never use the rubber base products before hard products because hard products will be lifted from uh, flexible and uh, soft products right, like rubber base. As a base for sculpting mix gel, you should use the special hard matrix base gel or the same gel, the thin layer of the sculpting mix gel. So it's much better to use uh, the, the sculpting mix gel as a base, uh, the thin layer, than any other unknown base gel. I always using the sculpting mix gel as a base when I don't have with a special matrix base gel. So you should be reminded that uh, you, 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 you shouldn't use the rubber products under the hard products. But in opposite way you can use the rubber top coat uh, on the top on hard products. This is normal and you will never have problems. So what to do in this case when you have a mistake? In this case you should remove all the product, the sculpting mix gel and the base gel. Remove right uh, to the nail plate and do everything from the beginning correctly. The first thing you should do is push cuticles to the limit. I mean to prepare the nail plate for placing hard product. In, only in this case we, we will have chance to apply product close to cuticles and we will have problems with floated product on the skin. Now I'm showing you two types of um, of diamond drill bead. From now I'm using the correct high quality diamond drill bead, uh, which will work for you for a long time. It's long lasting drill bead and it removes the uh, hyponychium perfectly and quickly. Another time type of drill bead, it, 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 uh, the Chinese drill bead with uh, the pieces of uh, nickel aloe with the steel that type is not good enough because it traumatized the nail plate it's too hard and it's, it's it doesn't work with dark uh, hard uh, dead skin the same way as high quality diamond drill bead and this is very important thing that we should remove all the dead skin in this area to avoid any liftings. We should work with the forward speed from the left side and with the reverse speed from the right side. The best choice uh, of this diamond drill bit is uh, with the blue line and with the red line. The blue line, this is the medium, medium grid. And the bit with the right, uh, with the red line, is soft. After removing the pterygia, I'm using the file uh, with the corner and moving this file in cuticles, cuticles area up and down. This is needed for prepare this area for placing the jaw, so we will have no liftings. Now I'm, we are comparing two types of nails uh, nippers. You can see that from the right side we have high quality nippers and from the left side nippers with bad quality. Um, it's very easy to compare them. Um, and we have on shape of nail top com only high quality 
nippers and scissors with the logo of shape of nail and um, as you can see good nippers cut easily I even don't press on uh, on the handle it, it is, they are removing the skin like butter so we just easily and neatly remove the skin I think even the child can do this work I think uh, every every woman should have should has such tool for self usage because it's very easy to correct the skin and sometimes when uh, we have such problems with the, uh, the cuticles you can cut the skin very easy but if we prefer ordering nippers with bad quality maybe you save a couple of dollars but uh, you will be nervous using them because they are not so good and they work as something heavy something uh, blunted um, ju they just don't cut the skin they just bite the skin not cut I'm using the gel primer for preparing the nail and uh, now I'm showing you the special matrix paste gel which I'm applying with thin layer and we cure this uh, base gel in one minute in lead lamp remember guys you should cure in lead lamp I mean powerful lead lamp upper than 30 watt it may be 36 for example but it's enough for curing this product but if you have less powerful lead lamp you should uh, the time of polymerizing is increasing so let's tear off the form and stick it stick it on the on the finger uh, place it on the finger like like you can see on the video right under the nail on the natural nail uh, you know uh, old techniques tell us to remove the natural nail to the skin but I think it's it's not need to do that because you may have cracks in this area it's better to leave one two mill, 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 millimeters of uh, natural nail like you can see on the video and you, you, as you can see the consistency of sculpting the gel is perfect uh, it doesn't flow and it's very very easy to sculpt the nail this way using this gel so here we go we have cubed though that nail in lead lamp and we are proceeding with the other nail placing the form and applying the next the next nail I'm using vintage gel brush as you can see it's very easy to use this technique you don't need to uh, use any special liquids any special pushers tools like in case with poly gel just dip the brush into the jar take the drop and place this drop on the nail move up and down easily and place it in lead lamp rotate hands so we just meditate you just can meditate and have a good time working with such amazing product it had it has no smell 
it doesn't burn the nail plate so your client is uh, very happy just real pleasure to work with such product by the way uh, we now we have birthday of our store and um, we have the special price for this gel 50 milliliters only for six dollars yeah guys only six dollars for big container which will be uh, long lasting and which will work not only for one client it will be enough for do about 40 or 50 50 clients I think it's very good that we we pay only uh, we pay cents for product and that's great that the quality of product is good don't be confused with the type of sculpting mix gel because we have two types of, of it um, please read the information on the name of the product the new formula thick new formula is the kind of gel like you can see on the video which can be used for building nails and the another type of gel is more liquid formula which can be used for sculpting nails and for inlay the second type of gel was invented for quick work to make the work faster so you just you just dip the brush into the into the container of the gel take the drop and apply the drop like uh, the top coat of the gel polish with which ha has medium thickness so you can rotate hand and to to make gel be aligned by itself so it it will work for um, nail technicians who prefer work fast then don't uh, sculpt nails at all okay guys you see me shaping the ballerine shape of nails and as you can see it's it has good shape already and we don't have to shape it at all just correct some side walls and the flow of the gel the conjugal bit will help us to create the c curve or the arch this is the good thing this way nails will look much better as you can see the ballerine goes arched <laughs> uh, and of course only this type of drill bit will help us to do it because it's it, it has medium hard medium hardness of toothing and uh, the shape of this drill bit is cone which is not rounded you can also use this drill bit for removing the product in cuticles area and only only this drill bit will help you to do that because it's it has it is like a cone and it also has no sharp edge like chinese drill bit like chinese drill bits they they have sharp edge which uh, will will uh, cut the skin of your client so that those drill bits are not was uh, invented to the to the limit i mean um, the manufacturer didn't thought about didn't think about it while when doing when producing those drill bits about safety of that those products i don't know why they are too sharp I like drawing one stroke flowers, especially roses, 
these are my favorite type of roses. I like free. I like uh, drawing it with free motions. And as you can see, my brush is wide. You can order this brush on shapeofnail.com. That's the name of this brush is the brush for one stroke painting. This is very soft brush, and I think this is the best brush for this technique because I have tried a lot of different brushes angular brushes or any other brushes and try to um, draw one stroke flowers of course some some types of strokes are easier to draw using the angular brush but I like drawing all with only one type of brush only with a flat brush for one stroke technique and also I like drawing compositions with thin brush number zero zero or three zero you can also order these brushes on my store shapeofnails.com the top cut I have I have uploaded loaded the container with this top coat I just like uh, use it from the container don't like using the bottles as you can see in my videos I don't like using glass bottles they are always dirty they are always flowing and dropping on the floor and crashing the I think containers are more stable and it's easy to work of course there are more smell from such containers because the larger area of uh, the product we have but um, if you have good dust collector professional dust collector that's removing all smell on the street that's not problem I think these nails are fantastic what do you think about this nail design and this shape of nails they're very very beautiful I like it what do you think about it let me know down in the comments see you in the next videos guys all products you can order on shapeofnail.com we have big birthday sales see you in the next videos guys bye